Hello guys, Andy here. Well, as you see, I'm halfway with my EZ8. Uh, it's assembled, it's primed with an ultimate primer, the black one, which is beautiful stuff. Buy it if you don't have. And it's base coated, that's a olive up by Tamiya, I believe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, what can I say? The CZ8 is just a small masterpiece of Tamiya engineering. This is a Christmas gift for my son, but I know uh, you can buy it for about 28 British pounds and it's definitely worth every single penny. No flashes, no unnecessary ejection pin marks. Every single part is fitting excellent. So, well guys, if you ever had any doubts about buying this car, this, this particular kit, well, grab your wallet or credit card, find your nearest hobby store and, and buy it. It's, it's definitely worth it. Uh, the barrel comes in one piece, so not too much work on it. You don't even have to think about buying, you know, the, the off-market part. And yes, well, it was a great pleasure. I don't really enjoy usually uh, with, uh, assembling all this, this hundreds of parts together, but this time it was a joy because it was absolutely stressful it was even a pleasure uh, there's one more thing I would like to show you guys it's not about the skid but about well something I bought uh, a few days ago a sweat and drying sanding set I'll show you what's inside. That's a nice plastic box, and you have a sponges, sanding sponges. You can cut it on the pieces. You can bend this. It's very handy, very useful, and it cost me only a four British pounds. So, if you will find somewhere. This set, well, it's worth to buy. Mm. So, well, this is it, guys. There's not much to tell at the moment. I will keep you up to date with the weathering process and, and the building a dial because I um, intend to build something well, as usual <laughs> it would be shame to do not build a proper dial or at least a, a vignette for such a fantastic kit like, like this one so have a nice day guys keep yourself warm and well see you soon bye